How you doing, Dr. Locke? Your on-campus legal attorney. Here with some free legal advice, but you're in luck because today I'm giving out a free science lesson. Yes, everybody knows for every action, there's an opposite and equal reaction. For example, summer of 2006 saw a major uprise in the African-American community. That was your action. The opposite and equal reaction some women on Winston State University campus took it upon themselves to support the movement by not getting another relaxer. So, be careful what your action is because the effect could be some students reenacting the color purple. 2006 also bear witness to the hit single released by Beyonce called Irreplaceable. It led a vast majority of women to walk around with the swagger of a goddess. They would hit you with phrases as, to the left, to the left. And they would also tell you, you must not know about me. And they would just walk around left and right, turning men down left and right. That was your action. The opposite and equal reaction would, when you get men in a crowded club, all upset because women would turn them down left and right and they're in a crowded club with irreplaceable women there's nothing left for them to do but fight so women if you want to be treated like Beyonce which could be your action your opposite equal reaction could be tr being treated like Beyonce's former group members before I go I just like to say you know every day won't be sunny every they won't be a Monday. Every charm won't be lucky. Every puff won't be cuckoo. Every Tar Heel won't go to the Final Four. <coughs> go Duke. But I'm saying that to say this. You know, a couple months ago we had problems with the financial aid office and with the registrar's office. And you know, the students all had a problem. Came up to me and they said, Dr. Locke, what do we, what do, we do? And I said, first you got to let them know that you mean business and then they went around they got petition signed and they said financial aid registrar what you're going to do is you're going to give us our class and those students they got their classes and I would like to salute them and if you would like to salute any of those students that bled sweat and cried for their classes you can find them in the Winston-Salem State University breezeway yes down in the breezeway where you can cry Bleed and sweat for your class, but you won't go to it because it's 80 degrees. This message was brought to you by Dr. Locke.